Welcome back guys. I literally just woke up like five minutes ago. <laughs> but yeah, my um my tools here to fix my bike. I'm gonna fix my crank set and um put a new chain. So those are two things that I'm gonna show you guys how to do. I hope you guys enjoy the video. And now let's get to it. Yeah. Alright guys, I got the part, um, it's small enough and affordable, so I was like, you know, fuck it, I gotta take it. And, you know, I'm not gonna open this chair right now, but it has the chain breaker and the, um, the key that I need. But yeah, so let's go. Alright, so here's the crank that broke. I took off these already, so, I mean, that's easy, just use it and I charge this out. And then I got the new rim on, but just keep it up okay. yeah let's get into it all right guys so i opened it up and this is an eight millimeter so you're gonna use this one to put this one out um put it in here and then you're gonna spin the shit out but yeah let's get into it <laughs> all right guys so how to use my foot to take this off this thing is legit the hardest thing i've ever took off the hardest thing is i'm gonna take how to take off this crank without a crank puller but i'll, I'll find out how it's gonna be hard though Alright guys, so like after like an hour of trying to figure out what to do, how to take this off, all I did is um, put these pliers, put these pliers together like this, and I put it in here, and I just like hammered it out, I hammered, like I hit this spot, this, this spot right here, I'm sorry, <laughs> and it just like came off, but I did it all around a full circle, if you can see, and that helps you get it off, you know what I'm saying? I don't know how I'm gonna get this one off now. Alright guys, I'm done taking it off. That I think the other arm was like the hardest thing to do. So buy it buy a crank puller. Might as well save you some time unless you wanna be like me, you know. Whatever, but you know, bike's pretty dirty. Here's just a frame. Nigga, go go watch your Peppa Pig. Alright now, so I'm put so I'm gonna put the crank set on and then I have to put both wheels on to see how the chain's gonna be, so I'll have both wheels on first. All right, so I got the wheels on. It's kind of weird. I'm gonna paint this. This is ugly. I know there's more steps to put just putting them in. Um, I know I'm supposed to put something in it, but I kind of it's hard to slippery. But make sure when you put in the crank set, they're like this. One's facing that way, one facing that way, because that's the only way you're gonna be able to ride the bike. Because if you put it, I don't know how you're gonna put it. Like put it both that way. You're gonna, I don't know. But yeah, make sure that happens. One up, one down. Put this in um, to put a cloth over it and then hammer it so it won't like mess up your paint or whatever. And then tighten this real hard like until you cannot and then tell someone else to do it because these things get loose and then you're pretty much fucked if they do. Sorry for the words, but um, now it's just the chain. Easy, easy part. All right, guys, easy part. So this chain's all right. I mean, they're not bad. All black, because you know me. Oh my goodness, I hate this kind of plastic. You just fucking stretch, stretch, and you will not open this thing. Let me get a knife. It looks like a condom now. Alright, these parts right here, they're important, so don't lose them. <laughs> like I just did like five minutes ago. Alright, well, this is hard. So, the part is, you're gonna put the chain all over the thing and see where it fits perfectly, and then you cut it. All right, guys, all you gotta do right here is get this part of the chain and this part and see right, right here where it lines up. That's where I want it. So I'm gonna take this one off, this link off, and put on the, the link they gave me. So I'll hold it. If you hear a cracking noise, it's alright. That's when it means it's coming out, so you're good. Yeah. But yeah. Uh, see where I told you these parts come in handy? Oh, it does. Because this is what holds on to the other piece. Of I'm gonna put this one right here, through here. I'm gonna get this one. This part in here. 
And then you grab the last part, which is this little clip thing looking. Put it in here. All right, I got it on. Um, it's only loose because, you know, I haven't put the wheel back or anything. I'm gonna do that right now. And that's pretty much it, guys. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I mean, it was easy, easy work. It's just that little thing that's really hard to put in because it has like little clips so it can hold on to the link. But yeah, um, I had this bike chilling for like about three months, four maybe, because I got hit by a car and I was like, nah, I'm not gonna fix it. And then I was like, you know what, I need to fix it because I'm bored. So yeah, I'm gonna clean it up and then I'm ready to ride. Finally, I have this thing all fixed. It's all done. Um, it's a little loose, but it's better to loose than really tight. I'll probably fix it eventually, but not right now. I'm trying to just ride. My tires are flat, so I can't ride right now because I don't have a pump. So when I get that fixed, I'll go out and ride. But yeah, if you guys have any any questions you guys got, um, just let me know, and I'll help you guys out. Please like and subscribe, and I'll catch you on this next video. Live life and repeat. Peace out.